Hey, what's going on guys? Retired and Happy here, back with another unboxing. Now this is the Poco M3. I bought this uh, as a gift for a friend whose phone is all jacked up. I mean, the screen on her phone, you couldn't read anything. And it's a birthday next week. So I decided to go ahead and pick up uh, one of these little inexpensive phones, which is the Poco M3. Uh, some quick specs. Let's see, doesn't appear to be anything on the box. Oh yeah, on these it tells you on the inside. So let me go ahead and open this up. And I bought this here, so they actually un uh, opened this up to show you that uh, everything was in here. So I'm gonna show you guys the way it comes if you buy it from, uh, I bought this out of Monterey Mall, okay? So this didn't come from like Falabella's or uh, K-Tronics. So first thing you get, is uh, some a pamphlet here that has, let's see, got a case, so it does include a case, and an instruction manual that no one ever reads. Now I did get a uh, one year warranty, you will need to give them your ID, and you get a one year warranty on this phone. So let's set that to the side. So you do get a case, it's a clear case. I mean, it ain't the best case, it's pretty pretty soft, but it's better than nothing, okay? Uh, I personally won't use it, I wouldn't use a case on this phone because of the back of it, and I'll show you in a minute, but it does, they at least give you a case. Okay, so here's the actual phone. This is the Poco M3. And if I look at the specs, so this has a 48 megapixel uh, triple cameras on the rear. So the main camera is a 48 megapixel shooter, uh, 6,000 milliamp battery. This is a 6.5 inch phone. So if I compare it here to the iPhone, uh, it's a little taller than my iPhone 11 Pro Max. So it is a little taller. Uh, and it has the Qualcomm Snapdragon 662. So this is not a 5G phone, but here in Colombia, 5G is not necessary. It's only in spotty places here at best. So I wouldn't even worry about that. So let's set the phone to the side and finish the unboxing here. So you guys see what else comes in this box. Um, nothing here. Okay, so this is a type A to type C cable right here. So this takes a type C charger, but as you can see, they give you the Euro. <laughs> you got the Euro plug. So yeah, this wouldn't work, but I have tons of type C, so that's not a big deal. And if she has any kind of charger, she can just plug this in, which is a type C. So that's all you get in the box. No headphones are included. All right. So let's set this to the side. And we're gonna unwrap this phone, take the plastic off. See if it has any power. All right. Comes out pretty easy. So I ended up picking the blue one here. It's not a bad looking phone. It's got a matte texture here. This is obviously plastic, so there's gonna be no wireless charging on this thing. Um, but not a bad looking phone in my opinion though. They have it in yellow, they have it in blue, and they have it in black. So I know she didn't want a black phone. Uh, it does have a screen protector that comes with it. So there's already a screen protector on here. She'll probably replace that, I guess, from the factory. So yeah, there is some power on here. Let's see how this powers on. Now the price for this phone as it's powering on was uh, $141. And this phone just recently came out that not that long ago, a couple months ago. So uh, this is a Xiaomi product. Xiaomi owns Poco, but Poco is kind of its own division so it's the Poco M3. Now they do make a better version of this called the X3 which is going to cost you around 300 bucks but this is all she needs. I mean it's a 48 megapixel camera in the, on, on the rear and the front. Uh, it didn't say but I would guess this is probably an 8 or between an 8 and a 13 megapixel camera in the front. So there it says uh, MUI 12. So this is a Xiaomi phone for sure. 
But all right, guys, I just wanted to share this unboxing with you all. Uh, I will be doing a update review on this phone, probably shoot some photos, and then I do have a video coming out tomorrow on a review, follow up from a one week review on the Samsung S21 Ultra. Let you guys, let you guys know what I think about it. You kind of already know, someone asked me about it in one of my lives and I still prefer this over that, but I'm still gonna do a review on that phone, show you some photos, show you some video, and uh, let you all decide whether or not you like it or not, okay? <laughs>